So you're telling me you can't do a lazy curl? Okay, well, what about a loose wave? I don't know. Why don't you stick it in a bucket of ice or something? I'm not a flaming doctor. Hello? Hello? <laughs> What's the matter? It's me wedding hairstylist. She's cancelled on me. Is that all? Yeah, for a minute there, I thought something terrible had happened. It has. She's got repetitive strain. Oh, well, she wants to get one of them wrist stabilizers. Yeah, I think I might have one in the drawer, actually. <sighs> I think I've burnt my bridges. She accused me of being unsympathetic. Oh, well, I wouldn't worry, because Matty's just full of fabulous hairdressers. You'll soon find another one. I want her. We spent hours batting photos back and forth, creating the perfect look. Oh. Hey, uh, you could always, you know, put it up in a Juliet cap. What? Or a fascinator, because they're very classy. Mm. Hey, good news. I have found you a stylist. If you say Audrey, if that's where you're going with this. I, would you give me some credit? No, I am talking about the lovely Maria. Spawn of Audrey. No, purely in a professional sense. Look, she's going to see you this afternoon and she is willing to work with you until you are happy. A full consultation, if you please. Go on, admit it. She's perfect. Maybe, if you're in your 80s and you're past caring. I want to look cool, not like someone's nan. She's still young. Maria's heyday would have been what? Late 90s, early 2000s? It'll be all zigzag partings and butterfly clips. And then if I survive all that, the thought of being held captive while she bangs on about the environment just kill me now. Maria, hi. It's lovely to see you. I'm not falling for that. It's the oldest trick in the book. <coughs> Maria. Hello. I, I was just talking about somebody that I used to know. Save it, Daisy. Whatever you think of me, I'm not thick. Do it at this rate. You're going to be turning up to your wedding in a Bonnie Tyler wig. Honestly, that gob of yours. Oh, I'm sorry. You 40 years too early. I only do pensioners. I'm sorry, Maria. I was a total cow. I know it's not an excuse, but I've got a lot on my mind at the moment. Not dealing with things well. I would love to talk wedding hair with you. Well, luckily for you, my five o'clock's a no-show, so... Poor old Doris has probably keeled over at the bus stop and died. Ugh. Well, I'm very grateful that you're giving me a second chance. Do you know what would look lovely on you for your wedding day? A nice big curly perm. I'm dead good at poodle cuts. <laughs> Something tells me that you've not quite forgiven me <laughs> for me harsh words. Really? I, I mean, I'd rather that, you know. Don't want you being nice to me face and then um, putting a big old <sighs> bald patch in the back of me head. <laughs> Someone's in demand. What's up? Believe me, you, you don't want to know. Come on, I can see that you're really upset. What is it? It's a long story. OK. Well, in that case, I shall go and stick the kettle on and crack open my best bickies. I had this weirdo target in me a while back. Planted a tracking device in my bag. No. Mm. Oh, that's horrendous. Yeah, I nearly threw up when I found it. It was the thought that he knew exactly where I was. It just scared the living daylights out of me. Yeah, cos that's terrifying. Yeah. I hated feeling so scared all the time. I thought I was strong and assertive, but it just turned me into someone that I didn't even recognise. Yeah, I know exactly what you mean. Mm. What did you do? Well, I went to the police. Well, I've already done that. All they said to do was write a list. A list? Everything he's ever said to me and everything he's ever done. Right, so take your list down to the police station and demand that they do something. I've tried. They're not taking me seriously. Well, then you need to pile the pressure on Daisy and do it as soon as you can. It'll be too late if they find you lying dead in a ditch somewhere. Maria? Well, I'm sorry, but you don't know what you're dealing with. And that's what scares me. I mean, look, the chances are it's probably just some saddle. But you never know, do you? 